suddenly he heard a beautiful song, Radhar Berakh Berakh. So nice. And that place was full of lanes, inter lanes. He saw how all through so many lanes and he went over the house and he was standing there, hearing it. Here these people, it took them a lot of time to go by which lane would have gone. Then there was a maze of, like labyrinth, there was a maze of lanes. Then at last they reached it. They found Guruji's uh, dhoti had fallen somewhere and he was standing. Thakur, this is Kolkata. Tamar Kamar Bukharna, it is not your village. And poor is standing. That is your dhoti. Shala, Ami Kuchi Amar Shuri Kutai. I am searching. Where is my body? Absolutely, nothing but mother matters. <laughs> Maharaj, you said about your guru's guru and his guru. Now you tell about your guru. Your guru, you have not told anything. Talk about your guru, Swami. Talk about your guru. Your guru. <laughs> <laughs> That uh, I want to hear that uh, Chandogya Vinisha. Chandogya Vinisha. He went in, going into Samadhi. Hmm? After? He was going into Samadhi. Yeah, but, uh, from, uh, oh, yeah. Your when, when you ch chanted Chandogya yeah, Vinisha, he went. <coughs> Andariyami Prakarna. You were reading Andariyami Prakarna. Ah, I wanted to see your Gurudev. Long back, um, as well as in 1950, I got a copy of the Gospel of Sri Ramakrishna and since then I decided if at all I get a Guru, I am too late for Ramakrishna Paramahamsa. But at least if at all I get a Guru, it should be in his lineage and it should be somebody like Thakur. He should have absolutely no bank account, nothing. He should never take any money from anybody. And he should not have, yeah, baby of Swamiji's kitchen, Swamiji, kitchen in charge, Swamiji, printing in charge, Swamiji, like that. No, it should be like a kuti of a marshi. And lastly, I saw, I was conquered. That's all. And everyone bothered well, from which lineage he comes, I never asked. I was so taken up with him. And he was coming almost every Saturday, like a like a mad cat was going to And uh, then one day I was thinking, huh, he doesn't keep any money. Nobody gives him. He doesn't take from anybody. Huh, he doesn't have a baby of Swami. Swami is not there. He's a little bit. Uh, there is no Krishna printing Swami. There is no Krishna kitchen Swami. Very I never seen him going to Samadhi state. I see him going to Samadhi state. This I was contemplated the previous night. The next day morning I was sitting at the steps leading towards the Ganges, looking at the Ganges. Suddenly somebody came and told me, Hey, Guruji calls you. I went upstairs. It was all you know. He said, Hey, Bring that book which is inside. See the third book which is very weak. There are only two biggest Upanishads. One is Brahmaranyaka, another is Chandrakya. I studiously avoided books. <laughs> I read all the other books, but these are too big for me. Then he, he asked me to bring. He takes on that page and read that prakarna. It is called Antaryami Prakarna. That is the chapter on the Indrada. The one here. The chapter on the Indrada. Antaryami. Ya Pradibhyam Dishthani. Ya Pradibhyam Antara. Tissa Pradibhya Shariram. Ya Pradibhya Namera. 
जो पृथ्वी में हमें थी द वन हु इज इन द अर्थ एंड शी कंट्रोल द अर्थ ही मेक्स इट फंक्शन एंड द अर्थ इज अ पार्ट ऑफ इज बॉडी इज कॉस्टिंग बॉडी बट दर्थ इज अवर नॉन the one who is in the yes same thing and whom the earth is the ears have never known the eyes the one who is there the one who makes it function but whom the ears have never seen like that this so beautiful i went through it was just one of the pages i was so absorbed i didn't look at it Now after finishing the chapter, I looked at him. Whether should I continue further? I stopped. I found the answer to some mystery. Oh, I got my book and I was looking at him. And suddenly, this thought struck me: the people in some of these states, do they breathe or not? <laughs> 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 so I went very near to him. <laughs> and escaping my ears, I heard the sound. Ah, he's <laughs> <laughs> a villager. That's all. And I was just looking at him, and just then I heard this footsteps of some of the seniors, uh, uh, Rishishas. I was never afraid of Swami. I was afraid of the teachers, <laughs> the senior teachers. <laughs> so I quietly wrote down, kept the book there, and quietly wrote down in my diary. I said, "Ah, he goes in the Samadhi state." This is the first time I saw the Samadhi state. I was very happy. But still, so many people told, "He is getting old. You take the shelf from him." I was so satisfied by seeing him. I came up to him in the shop on his own birthday, and it was four o'clock. After having served, a lot of mahatmas had come. I was serving only water, and even then, 